it's a new dawn, it's a new day. Welcome back everyone to the channel. It is currently 4.41 in the morning. Yeah, time to get ready to go to work. But back into the gym, chest day today. Looking forward to it. I do believe Ball Junior is actually joining. He did message me yesterday saying that he would be back. So that'd be awesome. Let's go and get ourselves ready for work. Well, pretty much ready for work anyway, as it is. Just need to grab a few bits on the way to the car and get off to work. So let's go and get up then. I've returned. Ball Junior is back in business. My shoulders are still dead from yesterday. Not a lie, my arm was dead after six aside last night. You meant to play for six aside with your feet, not your arm. Bear in mind, the guy who I went up against was like fucking this. <laughs> it was like shit. Yeah, chest day, guys. New exercises, so we can actually get those in there on the vlog for you. I'm looking forward to it. And I bet you're not. No. See you in there.
that, guys. <clears throat> Jeez. Just like that, guys, I'm back home. I've had a shower. I've had some food. I've had a parcel turn up. And I'm really excited to open this parcel. But of course, before we open up that parcel... Oh, yes. More Ouija Brothers. It's got to be done, guys. Speaking of Ouija Brothers, this is something to do with this parcel. I know it's not a Ouija board. That is one thing I would definitely, definitely not play with. That's uh, that's a no-go from Dozer. <laughs> so, uh, should we open up this parcel? I, I, I think we should. Yeah, let's open it up. So guys, here it is. Here's the parcel. It's like this. I've got to cover up this side. Can't show you that side because that's got my address on, but they've also put my address right there as well. So, great one. <laughs> but yes, guys, I'm, I'm really excited about this. I'm pretty sure I may have mentioned it about what I was buying or what I have bought. And oh my God, yes, you are here. Ooh, guys, this is going to be a step up in the changings for the uh, for the paranormal investigations. Guys, look at that. K2 meters. If you guys don't know what that K2 meter is, it's a EMF detector. Basically, it's an electric magnet electromagnetic field detector. Um, spirits let off um, magnetic fields. Uh, not magnetic fields, they're uh, electric fields so when i get close to it it starts changing the colors on on the screen here so uh yeah that's incredible that was a real good find and um, good price as well that was um 12 pounds um, and a lot of places normally they're they normally charge around about 25 30 pounds for it and they say it's a ghost detecting equipment this is the exact same thing and it was only £12. That, I'm well happy with. I've got to open it up. I need to see what... <laughs> I need to see where what batteries go in there. I need to know if I need to go and buy some batteries. I've always got a screwdriver handy. Let's have a look. See what batteries need to go in there. Okay, finally opened it up. Um, do you know what? I'm not 100% sure. I'm guessing... Double A's? Possibly, I don't know. Um, <laughs> doesn't really show me much. I have got the instructions here. Let's have a look. I'm gonna have a look and see uh, what it says on the instructions. Okay, I've checked it out. It's not double A's. I thought it's gonna be double A's. It's not. It's actually a nine volt battery. Um. Okay. Yeah. I see. I see how it sits in there now. Yeah. Yeah. I'm looking forward to using that. Oh my god, that's gonna be incredible. That is going to be absolutely incredible. You know, guys, literally for £11, about £12, £11 something, we call it £12. Can't really moan about that. That's a good price. That's a really good price. I'm going to give this one a try. This is one of the cheaper ones. I'm going to see what this is like. Um, I thought this is one of the ones that you was going to be able to just to, you know, put down and leave it there and it'll do its thing but you gotta push and hold a button on this one so so we'll give it a go see what it's like but i'm well happy that weren't meant to turn up until the 3rd of july and it is currently the 27th of june so um that seller is getting a massive like rating on their their website so thank you very much um to the guy that i bought this from Really appreciate that, and I appreciate that it got here nice and early, which obviously I'll be down to the delivery drivers, but thank you for getting it posted as quick as possible, I guess. So, really appreciate it. But yeah, that's that's incredible. If you don't know, like I said, guys, for £12, I'm going to try it. It is one of the cheaper ones, but if it does the exact same thing, but all I've got to do is hold the button, then, you know, you can't say any fairer than that. that that's, that's amazing, but that... It's going to come in so handy when we go do those investigations. Yes. Well, guys, just got to the gym. I actually forgot to record this morning. Um, I'll give you a guess what happened. 
If you guessed Dozer overslept and was nearly late to work, ding, 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 you are correct. I love my morning shifts, guys, but not when it's in the summertime. It's just too late, too late, late, too light at night. Bit of a tongue twister, that one. Yeah, I, I just I just can't sleep unless there is full darkness. Yeah. It's bad. But we are at the gym. Well, car park for the gym. Gonna go in. It is back day, so that means deadlifts, barbell rows, lap pull downs, and lap pullbacks. But it also means extra work on the chest, so I don't know if I'm gonna be doing dumbbell bench work today or if I'm gonna switch over to the uh over to the cable flies. I'm gonna see what, what's available to me when I get in there, but I can't recall because, uh, yeah, Ball Jr. can't make it today, but he can tomorrow. So I'm looking forward to that. And it's shoulder day, his favourite. He's going to hate me when he sees this. I know he is. But yeah, guys, I'm going to go in, go and get this done and head on back home after and relax. It's a busy day again today. As you can guess, guys, back home. Showered, changed, had food. Now it's time to semi-relax because I need to get this vlog edited and ready for your faces for today, which is course is Thursday. Oh boy, what a tough week this has been so far. I've, I, it has been a hard week. Um, I'm I'm not gonna lie, guys. Um, today when I got to the gym, I was feeling good on my way there. Got to the gym, started getting changed and. I had the doubt of me. I had the doubt of I'm not doing what I'm supposed to be doing in the gym. I've it, it's a mental game at times, and when the toughest battles is not the diet, you know, not sticking to your diet, what whatever the the well, the biggest battle is your mental battle it's pushing yourself i know i can do it i've been doing it for the last two months six days a week for the last two months and today it just felt like i wasn't seeing any progress but then i realized when i started the gym i weighed 109 kilos dead on I had no definition in my shoulders. I didn't have any definition in my arms coming on. My legs have got more toned. My stomach's got flatter. My chest is starting to take shape. And it's a mental battle. You have to keep turning up. You have to be consistent to get what you want from the gym. So guys, my, my ploy to you is if you want something that bad, you keep on fighting for it. And I want it to be a lot healthier. So I'm going to keep on fighting, even on the days where I don't want to go in. And today was one of those days when I got there. I did not want to be there. But I did it. Because I know future me is going to thank past me for making that choice to go, even when I didn't want to. Mental game is got to be on point, guys. It is the strongest battle. You know, it's it is difficult. I am I'm I have battled with the mentality game for a long time. And today was just one of those days. We all get them. I'm not saying I'm gonna give up because I push through today. But we're gonna end that note on a positive, and that is of course Ouija Brothers guys, you know me. This is another video I have not seen, and this is from four months ago. How have I not seen this? I don't know what's going on with me. <laughs> like I said, guys, mental battle it is the hardest part of it, but in the end, it's all worth it. Especially if it's something that you want fighting for. You know, so you just got to keep on pushing. <sighs> but the food is also really important. <laughs> Guys, thank you very much for watching. I really appreciate every single one of you. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe, drop a like rating, and ding dong that notification bell. 
all the way on so you get all the latest videos coming your way. So until Sunday, guys, have a good one.